we got a little bit of a tease in the pilot as to her backstory. We're seeing, you know, an ex-boyfriend who's just hinting that something's going on, though I'm guessing something isn't in the family life and that town, depending on you, Mr. Con Man. Yes. So are we going to be digging more into that as a episodes go on? Yeah, you'll definitely get to know the, the two women a lot better and see why he's why he loves them so dearly um, and, and perhaps why he shouldn't love them so dearly. Uh-oh. How's that? Oh. Ho. Ho. Someone's hiding a secret. Yeah. Maybe. He's not the only one, apparently. <laughs> yes. No, he is not. <laughs> I don't know the secret, by the way. I really don't. I don't know what I've He doesn't. But there is a secret. It. It's a oh, really good There's one. a secret. That's fantastic. So you've got something you're just like, just so you know, I know something that you don't. You're not the only one who can keep a secret here. That's yes, right. Absolutely. That kind of is nice to put them a little bit more on even playing ground. Totally. Mm. Because, mm. totally. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. Might give the couples more, you know. I have a husband somewhere else. <laughs> <laughs> That's not the secret. <laughs> that would be funny, though. She's like, you know what? I seem like a sweet, innocent kind, but guess what, dude? I'm actually fooling you. <laughs> right, that's right. I, I would be upset. It's fun. I mean, it's definitely a show of, of, of uh, gray characters. Yeah. Yeah. You know? There's no good or evil. Yeah. 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 It does seem like he's kind of building a house of cards for himself yes. right now. Do you see one lie in particular being the most likely to be the one that gets him caught? Is there anything that, you, mm-hmm. that stands out to you and you're like, that's going to just blow up in his face? Yeah. Um, well, you know, the, the, the thing is, is that I, I think that the, the, I think it makes it, it hard that he has created, he's, he's created this whole thing based on lies, right? Like yeah. he said, like a house of cards. And, and the, the queens in this castle of cards are these two women, right, that, that he wants to be in love with. So now he wants to keep them in the castle, but yet the castle he wants to deconstruct, he wants to take this apart and stop lying, and that's crazy. You know, yeah. it's like how do you delete part of the lie but keep the other part? So I think that's what's going gonna, gonna to come after him a little bit. His need for truth, which is a little bit ironic. Yeah, right. exactly. Yeah. So that's going to be what takes him down. Do you think there might be a time soon where the three of you might be in a scene together? What do you think? I don't know. Perhaps. Per chance. Per chance. Per chance. Or not. Very interesting. Because I was, I was actually talking to another co-star yesterday, and she was saying, she had a similar reaction. We were wondering maybe there could be like a dream sequence or something, because you would think his conscience That's might cool. just get the best of him, just to see the two of you act off each other. I like that. Yeah, I, I adore Adrian, and I, I would love to, to work with her. I think she's spectacular. Yeah. I think it'd be fun to see those two meet each other, because they seem like... Obviously, they have things in common right. that they wouldn't be able to talk about. Right. But at right. the same time, it seems like their differences would complement each other, and they could actually be friends if you know if they weren't sharing the same husband. Right. Because right. really, they do form the the exactly. perfect woman. You know, that's yeah. why he's in love with both of them. Yeah. Because they both of them together would be like. Yeah. Certainly. Goddess. Yeah, they would be best friends. Yeah. If they weren't married or dating the same man. Yeah. yeah. I'm pretty sure you guys just needed like big love it up. So that way you can have everything, have both couples together. This Bob way. buys a house in Utah. <laughs> yeah. The uh, but they would in. never stand for it. That's <laughs> yeah, what that's yeah. the that's what's different cool, you know? Yeah. Is, is that, that know, like, yeah. Lindsay would never, would yeah. never stand for that. Yeah, and it, it seems like maybe her past relationship wasn't so good, and maybe that's why she's a little bit blind as to what's going on right in front of her face. Yeah, I mean, I think we all have different reasons for not um, catching on or letting ourselves catch on to what's going on. Yes. <laughs> Do you have any frustration? I just went somewhere. I don't know where I went. <laughs> I went somewhere. I'm back. Yes. You're just like, you're like, no, I totally agree with what she's saying. Yeah. Just, you're being a supportive co-star. This is nice. <laughs> this is good. <laughs> this is, this is what how we go out to dinner. She, she orders, and I go, yes. <laughs> Start like a cheer squad. You know, just support everything she says. Just say, yes, this is exactly the right thing to say. <laughs> is it a little hard for you as, like, just as a woman just watching this character and saying, why are you not seeing these flashing warning signs that he's gone for such long periods of time? Or is it, you think it's just understandable? I think it's totally understandable. And it's been shocking, actually, doing all the press for this, how many people we've met who um, who either have or know someone who have experienced something like this. And, you know, there's our lives are complicated, especially these days when you can travel so much, so quickly. Um, and yeah. it, Tons of people live without their spouses for parts of a week. Yeah, you know? So I don't think it's naive at all for her to be in love with him. Last question. Uh, there's a change of uh, relationship status at the end of the pilot. Yes. Is that going to take the... Uh, yeah. So eloquently put. That, is, that was the most eloquently put ever. Thank you. Continue. Yes. You're welcome. <laughs> um, how is that going to change their relationship going forward? Because we saw a little bit of a taste of what happened, but yeah. it's, things are going to be different now. Well, like any good marriage between 
um, dating someone and getting married, nothing much changes. <laughs> and there's nothing to say. Except they're stuck together for the rest of their lives. No, I think, uh, um, I think that it's going to pose a, a more, I mean, th this guy really is getting himself in, in, in deep. And yeah. I think, uh, He's doing it because he wants to do it, because he believes he can make it happen, but certainly uh, it, it raises the, uh, the bar of uh, the anxiety for him, I think. Yeah. yeah. He added another crime to his list, basically. <laughs> exactly. Just rack him up.